it's your boy Andrew FAQ here with you with another video listen the weather is beautiful today and today I'm going to be discussing how to get more choosing signals in public let's go first point is being attractive to be attractive you've got to increase your sex appeal you've got to make sure your body's right I mentioned this in my previous video if you don't know this now you've got to be hitting the gym you got to make sure your body is in tone shape so increasing your workout increasing your diet that's going to improve your overall sex appeal you also got to be wearing certain outfits like shows your muscles like i know certain guys when they go out sometimes yeah they're wearing baggy fits it's not really it's not really compromising their body it's not really showing what the workouts they've been doing so for me when i go out i make sure that my tops are fitted to my muscles so my body's showing now so now my body's giving is giving the overall sex appeal of how my fitness is Females are gonna look at that and be like, this guy is in shape. Automatically, they don't wanna come and speak to me more. So increasing your sex appeals by getting your body right. Also, wearing the right clothing. Make sure that you're wearing a perfect good t-shirt. Dark colors sometimes does increase your um, um, sex appeal because it shows your uh, your body. And also, not too much like in your face when you're wearing like designer. Sometimes you're wearing like a uh, over colorful stuff. It's nice, you get the attention, but more time, they're just going to be like, okay, we're looking at you, but you're not really giving us that. It's a different type of attention you want. You want attention where you, your sex appeal is nice, not like, oh, you look like a clown because you're wearing all bright colored tops. I mean, don't be doing that. That is tip number one. Number two is for my, see, this is for my shorter audience. Listen, I'm 5'10", 178, but to increase your height is, man, is key in terms of attracting the opposite sex. I'm telling you now, having a good height, because women want when women approach you, they won't be looking up at you more time. So if you're if you're wearing flats and you're like five foot seven, five foot six, you're gonna you're gonna sort of limit your, your options straight away because some women ultimately are looking up for the taller guys. So what I do is I try to wear a thick two inch um, trainers to increase my overall height to make me come into being six foot, six foot one. Because I'm five foot ten, so that allow me to get even more choosing signals from, from the sex. Because if I walk around and I'm, I'm shorter than the other guys, it will limit my chance from them looking at me. And I'm telling you now, women are mostly looking up all the time. And if you're like on eye level with them sometimes, they will walk past you. I'm telling you, I've seen it out in public. I'm like, listen, if you want to increase your choosing signals, wear thicker shorts, thicker insoles. And even that, you can wear like an additional um, height booster that will boost your height. So whether if you're five foot seven, that will boost you up to five foot ten. Even if you're six foot one, you wear that, you come six foot three. Always trying to boost your height because I'm telling you, the taller you look, the more attractive you're going to be and the more shoes you're going to get. So now, I'm starting to do that now. I started implementing those changes and I'm noticing more choosing signals out in public. So make sure that you change the way you wear your trainers. Stop wearing flats. Make sure you wear a bit more big inner soles that's going to push, increase your height and overall you'll become more attractive to the opposite sex. Number three, put yourself in foot traffic what i mean by this is like go away places where it's busy where it's where, where, it's pop, where the population is more females than males i've been in public and i've seen groups of people just gather up together that's going to allow you to gain more traction by being in those areas because you get more choosing signals because people are around you if you go to places where there's less people you're going to get less less attraction but if you go to places where there's loads of people gathering around your, your choosing signal is going to go up because now more people are around outside they're going to be looking for, the, for you standing up so make sure that you go places that are more people around there's more people available that's one thing I would say don't chase women attract and obviously it's easy me saying and doing because obviously you say okay you're good looking but to get into that level you've got to make sure that you, you change the way you look change the way you dress and that's going to give you a more attraction appeal to the opposite sex. Women are gonna look at you as you walk past, they're gonna give you choosing signals. There's times here when I'm walking and my, my friends will be like, bro, that girl was checking you out. And because I ain't looking around at that, I, I, I forget who's giving me choosing signals. So now, giving eye contact to women is gonna allow you to see how many choosing signals you're getting. And eye contact is key to attract contact from the opposite sex. Eye contact goes a long way. So make sure you stay eye contact with the women. When you walk past them, they look at you, Give me a smile. There's times when I'm going to give me a smile. Notice you, notice me. And I keep it moving, keep it stepping. But that's going to give you your overall confidence. It's going to build your confidence overall. Number four is called the cheerleader effect. 
And what that means is that be in groups with other attractive men is going to allow you to increase your sex appeal. I'm telling you, when you're out with guys that are high value, knows how to dress, your group is going to get more attraction from, from women as you walk past. Women are going to see the group that are in shape, know how to dress, and that's going to allow you to increase your sex appeal. There's times when there's a group of high value men, high and they dress well, all looking good, but we don't know who the woman's looking at. So I'll be like, okay, look, you go check her out and see if she takes you on. But it's time, more times it's like, you go and there's a group of other women, you're gonna end up all get to speak to all the different women because they're in the groups, there are other groups of women and you're other groups of guys that are in good shape, are good looking. It makes you guys look a lot more better. So I always say, roll people that look like you, go with people that look like you, that dress well, if you're, if you're by yourself as well, it makes it um, less, more time less. When you've got groups of women you're by yourself, the two signals might go less because you're by yourself. But if you're in a group of people that look good, now to work, dress well, trust me, girls are going to be looking at the group that are in, are in good shape, are dressing well. Your group's going to get more eye contact, which will allow you to get more choosing signals. That's it, guys. Four points to help you prove yourself in public when approaching women. I hope you like this video. If you do, click the subscribe button, join the team, because now we are expanding. We're going to help men grow, help men improve how they dress, how they approach women in public, how to get more choosing signals, and overall how to become alpha males. Till next time, guys. Peace.